All right, I have set up a template for you guys, and this is an example of a print from that template. The goal for today is to import some geometry from Rhino into Revit and to let Revit analyze that geometry and give us information back on that geometry while being able to adjust the graphic representation, section, elevation, transparency of that object. It'll also give us a chance to look at how to navigate around in the Revit environment. Building information modeling has a lot of options, a lot of views, a lot of data, and it takes a little while to get used to working in that environment. So this will be an introduction to that as well. This PDF is an example of what you might be printing out for your um, final project. Also, Eventually what we'll do is we'll move from masses into component structures, so floors, walls, and roofs. And we'll also use different schedules, which you see over there to the side, to document that information. And we'll look at how you can update the information and have it update for you dynamically within Revit. Okay, so the next part of what we're going to be doing is importing that mass into Revit.